magical to be here. It draws so many hearts. It's just a special feeling to know that I'm still here and see all the people come here and support me. There's nothing like it. About six years ago, my son was diagnosed with leukemia, ALL, and he's been in remission. And he's doing fine. This is what cured looks like. You can go. You can start all over again. My son Sammy was diagnosed with T-cell ALL in September 2009. You just have to be there to support him. You have to know that he's not alone. Peter has been with Sammy thick through thick and thin. You know, I'm always there. I have to show him, like, what the other side looks like. He helps me, like, be brave. I was diagnosed with chronic lymphocytic leukemia. It was seven years before I needed treatment. Uh, I got a treatment that didn't exist when I was first diagnosed in 2001. My grandmother and my mother both died of AML. I was diagnosed with it. I didn't think it was gonna be great, and it is. And guess what? The uh, scientist who developed and tested that treatment was funded by LLS. There's a lot of reason to have hope now. Uh, things are getting better and better with treatments. So many kids and young adults with cancer, particularly leukemia and lymphoma, can be cured, and it's all a result of research funded by the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society. Maybe someday we'll figure all this out. Anthony was diagnosed with uh, acute lymphoblastic leukemia. We have hundreds of people coming to support, you know, Anthony and the cause. When I see all the people out there and, and the balloons and just, it's just so overwhelming. The white ones mean that an awful lot of people have been affected by cancer and the red ones mean that so many people are out there supporting us. The gold balloons in memory of those who didn't make it. The most important thing I've learned from this experience is that anything can happen any given day, but you just keep your head up high and you just keep going. I had strangers coming up to me, you know, saying, listen, can I give you money? Can I donate? Can I, where can I go? That's the first thing you just have to ask. There's a lot of people out there that want to give. They just need to be asked. Guleha Lawrence is pleased to participate in Light the Night. So many of our agents have been touched in some way, shape, or form with, uh, with cancers. You know, we can do this. It's going to be bumpy. We're going to have very hard times. Sometimes one of us will fall apart. The others will be there. And that's what the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society has done most of all for us. Walk as if your life depends on it. Walk because someone's life does.